All right, I'm on the hole number four of the Great Outdoors Tournament. I'm in Tuesday's qualifying round in the Ricky Division. Let's go to Golf Class Notebook and check it out. All right. I do not have my notes with me, so I'm just playing. I'm going to take a Viper. Because that's pretty much the only wood that I have. I need to open up some chests. These bad boys rolling. Viper, ten percent, ten percent wind adjustment. This hole almost plays. When you have headwind on these ones that you're doing these wind adjustments on, when we're in the tournament and we've got tailwind and we do a 10%, it almost feels like when you're in regular play and you have a wind, uh, headwind, you almost need to do a bigger adjustment. I like to come at it from the right, but there are numerous different shots here. I have seen the shot where people pull straight back and hit over the sand and go at it that way. In the upper divisions, I see a lot of people coming at it from the from the left. That's because from the upper divisions, you may end up here with a driver. This is a great hole for a Thor's hammer. <coughs> oh, excuse me. That felt so good. Okay, 10% would be 3, 3. That's 3, 8. Little shy of that. Give me a perfect. Get a look. Not a very good look, but it's a look. Oh, I guess it was a pretty good look. Not bad. Could have been just a little bit better. Just chilling out today, getting a wrap on my work vehicle. Waiting for my painter to get here so we can finish fixing the bodywork on my vehicle. All right. Would have been better just to make that shot. Hitting it perfect in the hole. The deal is, is if you come on to a course like this, some of these par fours, at least the first one are going to be difficult if you have lower level clubs to put yourself in the right spot. You'll still have a shot. But the deal is, is that if you give yourself a shot in the weekend round, if you give yourself 18 shots to pick up one and you just play consistent and you just pick up a couple of them, that's huge. That's top 10 material. So you don't have to go out there and it's not like, uh, you know, Tommy or something where you got to sink every single shot. You don't need to sink every shot. You just need to pick up a couple here and there, but you can't drop any. You got to play consistent. All right, that was hole number five of the Great Outdoors Tournament in Tuesday's qualifying round of the Reiki Division. Thanks for watching.